Can I kill myself? Oh, wait a minute. Uh oh, a little, a little glitchy there. I didn't. What did he just say? I wasn't paying attention. I was fucking about. Can't jump. Or... It's just weird, cause like if you go by my height though, with this building, I mean you could roughly say the building's 20 foot tall, but it's supposed to be like a warehouse. Yeah, I also I wasn't paying attention to what he was saying, so now I just I don't know if he gave me a hint to where I'm supposed to go. I was too busy critiquing. Well, these doors. Wait, these doors are about the right height. So now here's the question: Are these six foot doors? Was I a kid in the school scene? Or are these like four foot doors and we're a midget land? We did it. Wait, what the f <laughs> Where the fuck am I now? Prison? Fuck is happening. It's all red again. This is what I was talking about emergency lights, but Jesus Christ. Oh, did I open that? Oh, do I have to go open everything? Wait, was that something up there? Pitch black where I can barely control the mouse. Not pitch black, but I can barely control the mouse. Can't control the fucking flashlight. Now I have to open every container and like weird ass angle my flashlight. I'm pretty sure this game said it had a jump key, but uh, sure ain't space. That's the whole story of this game is I'm a midget and I'm growing taller. Okay, well that would, ow. So I have to be, okay, so I have to be like on everything to open it and the doors glitch through me every time. Is this just, am I gonna be chased by, wait a minute, was I in this room? I wanna have to open everything and fucking dink with my camera to get it to, to fucking work right. Ugh. If I could fucking control the goddamn flashlight, it'd be a lot easier to see shit. Just saying. I ain't mad. I'm just saying. This one's just fucking out in the open? Is it, wait. Oh. I might have missed something and just not been able to see the f Stop moving flashlight. Oh, fuck me. Okay, I can't pick it up, whatever the fuck that is. Open, close. Someone rolling a marble around? Is that just stuck on my screen now? Could you go away? Oh, wait, what? Oh, oh! Okay, so, uh, I think they're all the same. I don't think it matters. I think I just got to go. Do I have to go back to every fucking thing I open now? Ah, come the f I think that ticking sound is supposed to be spooky, but it is actually pretty obnoxious. It just kind of sounds like you've got neighbors upstairs. Like, the, it sounds like, uh, you guys ever had lived at a two-story place and had a dog? Upstairs. It sounds like they're toenails clicking shit. Oh, wait. A oh, Jesus. What the fuck are you? That startled me. I didn't think there was anything in this fucking game. I'm gonna have to go open everything just so I won't have to do it. Why spider fucking things? And I don't mind the chase too much if I could, like, if you're in a hallway, that's just it. You know, you can't move around them. Give, give me some fucking space. Man. Did I not go this way before? Probably. Okay, we're just gonna open everything we see. So I have a feeling we're gonna have to run in circles without being able to aim our fucking flashlight at anything. Okay, the demon should spawn like right down there, right? I think they spawn right over there. We'll wait till we can see them. Oh, that's the, uh, the tippity tappity sound. That sounds really sounds like someone's rolling a marble around or something. So I, I have a strong feeling that... Did I grab that one? Okay, I did. I have a strong feeling this is the whole game. What you're seeing now. Just some weird, like, walk through this area and you're done type of puzzle. And then collect some shit while some kind of monster tries to get you a puzzle. Seven chapters? Alright. Do I have to leave, you think? I, I don't think I have to leave. Should we try it? Okay, can't leave. But I think the monster's at the end of this hallway, so I can't even go down that way. He couldn't figure out his pathing there for a second. He just stopped. He's like, uh, I don't know. Damn it, pick it up. All right, so I think, do I need six of them? Yeah, or yes. Okay, he's on the, I think the other side of the wall. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna be searching for this last one. Oh, fuck. Unless it's in one of these cupboards. I think that was, that was him down there with him. So I've already gone to like every spot in this area. I feel. All right, let's try it anyways. So I wanna try going to the right, but he's over there. So I guess we'll wait. Does he path? Yeah, I went down that way, didn't I? Someone's rolling a fucking can down the goddamn hallway again. Really, fucker? Could have just gone that way. Did you just pat back and forth in that tiny little area? Fuck it, we're making a break for it, man. Looking for a cupboard. Uh, did I go down this way? Think I... Oh, no, I didn't. I've got the eyeball pentagram thingy thing. Oh, wait, is there a spoople up here? Huh, neat. I don't know, it's like a baby. Oh, no, don't catch me. That'd be really annoying. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. It's the toy uh, Sid made with the baby doll head. Yeah. I'm already halfway through the game, dude. Now, see, now I'm at a circuit. It doesn't make any sense, these transitions. Like, you'll go from school to hell school to 
you know, butthole and then outside and then you're you're in a jail and now you got a circus. And I'm remembering something, maybe I'm dead. It does look a little bit like Bioshock. It looks a lot like Silent Hill 5, where you started at a carnival. Yeah, this, this game did buy top quality assets. I doubt they made any of them. Yeah, it might be in a coma. It might be the same thing. This kid's, the kid's got no fucking... I mean, I... It, okay, so let's just assume that voice actor is the dev. He sounds like he's like 19, 20. I mean, we could get him a bit of a break. So there was something stupid... Let's just ride the carnival. Or not the carnival. Jesus, now I'm bigger than shit? What the fuck is this? Why, why am I... Am I growing throughout this game? Like, I'm taller than... What do you call these? A gondola? I'm taller than the fucking gondola. I can't even get in the fucker. I'm like, what, seven foot, eight foot now? Those things are pretty fucking big. Jesus Christ, game. Figure it out. Oh, wait, no. No, I'm still I'm still tiny, I think. Still still a three-foot boy. These gondolas are made for toddlers. What the fuck? I think I'm supposed to go inside of this demon fucker here. Oop. Oh, no. I have to go find a fucking key? Motherfucker. It's going to be somewhere dumb, isn't it? Oh, is it in the gondola? Out the butthole and into the mouth. Like anywhere around. I guess I should start checking the floors of the gondolas. I don't know. Is that are they actually called gondolas? Did someone Google that? Am I just sounding like a jackass right now? Yeah, I didn't know this was a game jam game. If you make a game in 48 hours for some kind of like contest or event or something, don't fucking charge five dollars for it. Come the fuck. Please. Yeah, it's a Ferris wheel, but the 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 things you actually sit in they're not called like Ferris wheel cups. I think they're. They're called something. The fucking key is just laying on the ground. I'm so disgusted. <laughs> oh, just, you're making me just check the dumbest spots now. You've already shown me once, you're gonna throw shit, you'll throw shit on the ground. It could just be on the fucking ground. So if I ever want to find a key, I gotta open anything that could possibly open. For fun. Unless I'm looking for like ammo, guns, medical supplies, something like that. <laughs> and then you throw it on the ground, so it could be anywhere. You just fucking, just everywhere. Check everything. Honestly, I mean, it's 50-50 when you play horror games. It's always 50-50 when you play horror games, if they're going to be good or not. Because they could look amazing and be fucking terrible. Like that game I played, uh, Stay in the Light, I think it was called Stay in the Light, where it was showing off RTX and all that shit, and how good ray tracing was. Fucking horrible game. But it looked really good, so they're, they're deceiving. Anyone can make a trailer look good. And there is no keyhole for the doors. But the doors change in shapes and sizes anyways, everywhere you go. And there's another huge one. It's not even a, I wish I could tell if there was a doorknob, but I can't adjust my camera and my flashlight to sync up at all. Oh, please tell me they're gonna take one. Long hallways are fucking stupid. Oh yeah, there's definitely gonna be a jump scare somewhere. Oh, I can see him down there. Long hallways are boring. Oh no, my flashlight stopped working. Stop. Oh, is he behind me now? Oh, oh yeah, there he is. Oh God. He looks like someone from like some weird electro goth music band or some shit. Maybe just go say hi to him. Okay. What's up, bud? Oh, um, the dude with the afro just slinked down into the water and swam past you. <laughs> oh, oh, now you're over here again? Oh, wait. Oh, he's peeking. He's like, hi. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, it's pretty fucking dark, isn't it? Yay. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Was that supposed to be like, Bob, Bob, where did he go? Standing, I went close. There's no bathtub or I any. Okay, wait a minute. So, standing by the bathtub, stand motion, then go towards the mirrors, and they'll guide my way. Can you repeat what you fucking said? Okay. Standing near the bathtub, hear two sounds. Or hear it behind me and walk towards it. Now I stand motionless. Fuck, what did he say? Maybe just stand by the bathroom for a bit. Bathtub. Fart sound really undercuts the horror. I don't know. I think that I think it's a pretty good little fart sound. I think it makes sense. Maybe if we just don't move at all. Sounds like someone's creaking a door. You know. Do, do I move? Oh no. No sit sit motion. What? Man, just fucking repeat what you said. I just fucking leave. God damn it. <sighs> do I gotta open something? Oh. That's a... <laughs> I'm trying to figure out. Okay. Okay. Hear the first sound. I move towards it. Second one, I say I'm motion. Maybe third one, I say I'm motion. And then I move to the mirrors that guide my way. Am I, am I supposed to fucking catch the guy or something? Okay, hold on, let's try this again. There's the toot. Oh no, scary. I'm gonna stop. Okay, that didn't work like I thought. I thought maybe when the light cuts out, I can walk through the mirror or some shit. Let's try it again. Okay, run, stop. Okay, can I... Am I supposed to like hug him or some shit? Can I try hugging him? I'm gonna try to grab him. When the lights flicker again. Unless I fucked up already and I gotta go back to the bathroom. Can you help me? Did the fart sound change? That was a that was a wet one. You can't like reset or anything either. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Let's try to load chapter. Wait, can we just load any chapter? Oh, what were we on? Five? Right? I think we we're on five. Okay, cool. 
Apparently we could just skip this chapter if we really feel like it. Okay, listen. Focus! Why is there a shadow fucking freaking out over there? Was that shadow always there? No, that shadow was. Oh, huh. can you start the dialogue? Do I have to make a lap around the room? Where's the trigger at? There we go. They wail? Okay. Oh, you did it. I couldn't tell if that sound was something opening or some other dumb shit. I'm. Oh, spooky! Uh, no, it disappeared! I'm spooked. Ah! My wife probably heard that. And now I get a cutscene? Oh, that's odd, but alright. Is there gonna be a jump scare? Something gonna grab me from the ceiling? Wait, am I. Am I playing? If you're gonna have a cutscene, just fucking open the door! Oh lord. <laughs> Why was there a cutscene to climb the stairs but you couldn't just have me open the door? Hey, it's a title screen. Alright, we got some numbers for you guys to write down. Five, six, two, one, seven, eight, four, three. So, uh, all of them. And, uh, hmm. Mm, that could be a lot of shit. It kind of looks like a dude coming a fucking light beam, though. Like, that's the leg, the, the hips right there, and the dick, and it's... Alright, where's the trigger at? Oh, there's definitely something in the dark. By the way, it says I can hit F for flashlight. No. Alien badge? Could be an alien badge, yeah. Okay. That move? Oh, no, I'm just... Ooh, that was weird. Cardboard. Ooh. And dressers. Uh, okay. So that says three. Does that mean I have to, like, go click on three, maybe? We already went on these. Alright. Let's go, go back to the three. That's, like, our only guess. So... Oh, wait. Is this the... Oh, is it one of those things you gotta figure out, like... I don't... I don't actually know. A Lost Woods puzzle? What is that? Is that just like the teleportation shit kind of like in, in Zelda? Where every portal will send you to a different portal? So this was just telling me to start at 3? Yeah, okay. So it is a Lost Woods puzzle. Alright, 3 to 8. So now if we go into 3 again, does it just kill us? Is that what happened there? Just just testing it out, trying all the angles here. Oh yeah, he's right there. Oh, he just ran off. Oh, Did you see him there? I walked right past them. We gotta check something out. Because I think the jump scare, now this is what I want to check out. I'm pretty sure the jump scare monster, they used a wrong model. Because the model looked like the little tippity tappity Sid from Toy Story monster with the Barbie doll head. But the jump scare was from the, the moonwalk in baby doll monster. Let's try this out. Yeah, I think they, they fucked up the model with the jump scare. Oh no, that's a whole different model. It's like a little snake guy. Yeah, he should be right here. Well, let's try to pull him back in the light a little more. Well, it's a different modeled enemy, but it's the same model jump scare. Okay. Anyway, so let's see if we can do this. We do. Tell me if I'm doing it wrong, because I think I remember. Nope, I did it wrong. He's all sneaky, but I gotcha. 